Okay, this is a quick troubleshooting tutorial on how to solve timer countdown issues uh, on swingway presses like the DK20S uh, or the swingway combo, which I'll show in just a minute. Uh, basically, when you close the handle, the timer should say timing and count down. When you open the handle back up, it should say open. If, however, when you turn your press on, it immediately starts counting down or it's not responding whether you open or close the press, first thing you want to check really quick, which is the easiest thing to check, is this timer trigger switch. Basically, if you notice, it triggers a small micro switch. And so when you open the press, it should trigger that and uh, press that button, at which point it says open. And when you close the press, it should release that, and it should say timing. Sometimes if you put an object here, or it pushes up on this, or somehow bends this, you might have to straighten it out, or reposition this so that this is pointing downward enough, and so that the button is getting contacted. So you want to make sure this is clicking up and down. You can do this by hand, just with your finger. And as you can see, it goes from timing to open. So that's number one. Make sure this is clicking up and down and the screen is changing. Make sure these two pink plugs are plugged into the top connectors and that this bottom connector is empty. And then after that, there's one other thing you can check if the timer is still not counting down properly. And that is, we can open up this control panel. And I'll just, I already had that unscrewed. Flip this on its side. And you'll notice on the circuit boards, this black connector right here. See this black connector next to the lime green connector. So you have a lime green Lego block looking connector and then this black connector is the timer connector. And this comes unplugged very easily. Sometimes it can happen during shipping or transit, but you'll see there's six holes in this black plug. And you'll see there's six corresponding gold pins on the circuit board. You want to make sure that all six gold pins, looking at it from the side view as well as from the back, make sure you plug into all six gold pins. It's very easy to plug into only three. So you'll see that just dropped right on there. Look at it from the side. Make sure you're plugged into all six hole, uh, pins. If all six pins go into that plug, and that will resolve your timer issue if it's not counting down properly. If it's counting down backwards, which means when you close the press it says open, and when you open the press it says timing, that means you have to reprogram the controller. The controller can be reprogrammed, we have instructions for that, uh, and you can just email us or look on our support page for the model programming instructions. This is the exact same setup on our digital combo press, swing up press. If we close this, you'll see that same trigger switch right here. Make sure that's actually contacting the heat platen and triggering. Make sure that the uh, two pink plugs in there, if you can see that, are plugged into the top connectors. And again, that black plug that plugs into the top of the circuit board into the six gold pins, exact same design as that swingway. And that's how to resolve almost all timer issues on our swingway presses, whether it's the 16 by 20 or the, uh, the combo press. Thanks.